Welcome back to George's channel, George Rocks Caffilly. Uh, today we're going to try out Lambradach Bauer Secure Dog Walking Field. A couple of weeks ago my mum adopted a little Jack Russell pup. Uh, she's one year old. We're not sure what she's like off the lead. Uh, so we've taken her for a few walks and she's a little bit yappy around other dogs. So we don't know what her recall is like. So we thought the best way to find out was to take her to a secure field. So last week we had an induction with Clay up on the farm and then we were given a login and we were able to book our slot. Uh, so it was easy, we just went on to the date that we wanted, choose, chose out of all the time slots um, and here we are, we're on our way up to the farm uh, for our slot this afternoon. at the field uh, is 10 to 4 our slot is at 4 so the rule is you wait in your car until you see the other um, occupant sort of come out just in case their dog is either people reactive or other dog reactive they get into their car safely um, and then we'll get out of the car and we'll put our code into the gate um, and then close it behind us so that anybody coming for the next slot knows that this heels in so we're just waiting for the other people to the leave The entrance now. to the field. If you get to the fork in the road, an actual fork in the road, you've gone too far. And you park, just park here. In. And this is Maya that we're going to take in. We're not sure what her recall is like. She's crazy. So we're going to have a go of let her off in the field somewhere safe, yeah. isn't it? Where we know she's not going to see any other dogs and see how we get on. So the people before us have left, so that means we're safe to go in. Can you hold her? So we go. Well, you only got to hold her to the gate, and we're going to see what she's like off the lead. So we're going to properly let her go. We're going to properly let her go. Field, and we've locked the gate behind us. There's poo bags everywhere, so you don't need to bring your own. And they're biodegradable ones, so we're only allowed to use those ones, George. Okay, and they're scattered around you. So, do you want to let her go and see yeah. and see Maya. how she is? Yeah. Hopefully she comes back. Is it, is it this place? Is this place just a big giant It's square? It's secure, it's covered in, it's got a 10 foot fence. And oh, then, what? oh yeah, it's really long and there's a forest at the bottom. So do you want to let her go? I think she really wants to get off. Come, right, her. give her a go. See if she, she's never had a run with us, has she? Oh my gosh, she won't let you. Ready? She's off. She's off. Here she goes. Go on. Go on. Go on. Come on then. Run, George. See if she runs after you. Hey, Maya. Go. Come on. Yay. Oh, look at her running. How happy oh, she God. is. Oh, wow. Look. Come on then. Come on. Come on. Maya. Maybe her recall isn't great, but then there's lots Maya. of new smells. Maya. Oh, Chris sniffing around. Oh, that is one happy little dog. Uh, it's quite a few acres, Claire told me. So if it's too sunny and your dog's too hot, there's a shaded area here. More poom bins and biodegradable bags. So it's not just a big open field. There's loads of places for dogs to explore. And George's. than I thought. So there's lots of ferns and trees. Oh, here she comes! <laughs> wow, look at her. How happy she is, George. Keep an eye that she's not going to toilet, George. I've got a poo bag in my pocket. Oh, look! Come here! Come here! Come on in! Maya! 
well, her recall isn't great. Hopefully this will wear you out as well, George. That's the hospital, we can see. she decides to come back. Come here then. Oh, she's not having a treat because she's not listening. <laughs> Let's walk this way then and see what's up here, is it? It's like every part of the field is something different. No one arrest you. Hiya. There's pool bags and another bin. Oh, George already fell. Maya, do the race. Racer. Oh, what's up here? Where are you I wonder how many hundreds of years that is. Old. That didn't really make sense, but never mind. No. <laughs> no. I changed my mind, I went up there. Go on then, chase her. Yeah. Well, it's a bit steep that hill. If we keep going, let's go this way, George. You'll soon follow us. All the way around the field, there's no way for your dog to leave, and it's buried over a foot under the ground. So, chances are they're not going to be able to dig that deep either to get out. So, it is truly a secure field. Yeah. Oh, she snapped, George. Now we know she don't go to let her off the lead because. She doesn't come back. She, she don't come back. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to have a little rest by you. Keep an eye on the dog. What have I found? This is, if she finds any toys, it's finders keepers, George. Lovely <laughs> and peaceful up here. Um, just knowing that the field is yours. And if you've got kids with you, they can sort of just run around and you know that they're safe. You can bring more than one dog, you can bring up to three dogs um, and that's £10 for the hour um, and we're, we're having a really nice time. We should have brought a picnic, George brought his drink, we've got to take our litter on with us. How much money is it for one dog? £10. How much for a free dog? £10. Why is it all the same? Bargain. BARGAIN! <laughs> and where's the dog? She's in the bush. Maya! So Maya's had a really good time, and so have we, haven't we? Yeah, I am so tired out. <laughs> She's walked way more than me. She's running all the time, She's isn't she? She's running, and I've been walking, and she is not tired out. She's still running right now, and I'm just chilling. So we I'm would tired. definitely recommend this for your dog, whether your dog is nervous or disobedient or just a bit aggressive. Um, around other people or other dogs. Uh, if you're nervous of other dogs, um, she's had a really good time. Uh, and you, you just need to book your induction with Claire and we'll put her number on at the end. Yes. Uh, but you, we'll certainly be booking again, won't we? You take, um, you're allowed one hour if yeah, you're with your dog. And you, she, she, they can just run around because... Yeah. She's exploring over there. It's like... She's back, but for how long? Two seconds. She's gone. I'm gonna go and follow chase her, her. Don't, George, to make sure you haven't got to pick up any poop. And it wears you out at the same time. <laughs> so the question is, how do we get the dog back on the lead? Um. She keeps running away. No chance. Claire said in an emergency we could ring her. <laughs> emergency. 
<laughs> we'll see. We'll see if it's an emergency in 20 minutes if we still can't get yeah. on the lead. Let's right, go. let's try. This is the challenge, trying to get this little monkey back on her lead. Good girl! Come on then! Sit! Sit and you can have a treat. Oh, George, she came back. Good Good girl! girl. There we go. There we go. Maya, did you enjoy that? Yeah! Think she'll sleep tonight, George? Yeah. Right, come on, let's make our way home. She's still exploring, she's still got plenty of energy. Come on then. So I guess we found out from bringing it up here that her recall isn't the best. Um, and if we take her off the lead in a park or something, she, she's likely to sort of run off. So we might sort of bring her up here for a few more times, just get her used to being off the lead uh, and go from there. Just our car in the parking area. Nobody else is waiting. But if they were, they'd have to wait for us to vacate until they got out of their car. But Claire explains all this in the induction. So that's our review of Lambradic Barrow Secure Dog Walking Field. They've got a Facebook page um, you can look at and Claire's details are at the end of this video. But for now, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Please thumbs up, please subscribe and see you in the next video!